So this is the studio I work in, and it's a wonderful, wonderful room. I start the day, even this morning, on the way down to have a swim, I come into this room because I need to see straight away what I've been working on. And for instance, this picture and this picture were wet last night. So this morning I can put them up vertically and see them. And with this picture, which is very abstract, very strong picture, it's like a next stage for me, uh, mm -hmm. I put these black marks on, on there this morning, knowing that they would run down a little bit. In other words, if I'd have taken this and laid it flat, they'd have just been black dots. But because I had to make them that way, I knew that it would be interesting to find these little mm. lines that came down. So I'm happy with this. And this picture is where we just were in the cave. It's the start of the cave painting. You can see I'm painting it over the top of something else. It'll be about being inside the cave and then seeing the things on the outside. And then of course, you know, my granddaughter's <laughs> painting. Well, I can't do better than that. Yeah. Yeah. All the, my it? grandkids love to love to love to come here and I love to work with them here yeah. in this room. I use the the um, plastic spades that you find on the beach for pallets. I wait till the child's actually lost one. I mean I don't <laughs> I don't hover in the bush and jump out and <laughs> grab the spade from the kid but I find them all on the beach and I've got lots of them and of course I, p I put them up here on the wall and they're and they're quite they're quite beautiful but also they're very handy things to use for for pellets and do you have more than one studio I do I've got a studio in the rocks in the gallery but this is the main studio